Solomon Gundy. Born on a Monday. Christened on a Tuesday. Married on a Wednesday. Greetings and salutations everyone, I am as always Darth Devious, bringing you another video review. This time from DC Collectibles, from the Arkham City line. It is the very large, very heavy, very highly detailed Solomon Grundy figure. Um, there's an iconic battle between Batman and Solomon Grundy who's being controlled by Penguin in the game if you know that um, and that's why he's got chains on him and his chest panel comes off which I'll show in a little bit just like it did in the game this guy is massive um, I can't get him in the whole shot you can see here's my hand and there's his feet he weighs about 10 pounds he's not a light figure whatsoever that he has articulation is a miracle in and of itself I mean just Let's just zoom in. Look at that head sculpt. Very creepy. Very gory. And you can see there the veins that they painted on his arms. And the detail that just goes down, 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 all the way to his feet. He is a massive, massive figure. Um, if we take his chest plate, this is a soft rubber. It comes off. You can see there's the detail. You got his skin. You got his ribs. Here you have his guts, his heart. Um, I'm not sure if the heart comes out or not. I don't think it does. It probably can. It, yeah, it does. His heart comes out too. So if you want to play with his heart, and his heart's got some nice detail to it. The way they, they airbrushed it, very nice. Put that back in. <laughs> Stay in there. And you just put this back on. It's got, you know, metal pieces that hold it back on. Well, it's rubber, but it's molded to look like metal. And yeah, I mean, this guy is just massive. And I'll show you how massive in a minute. Um, articulation, his head is on a bit of a ball joint or whatever that DC joint is that they use. And so you get a lot of movement in it. <sighs> You got the shoulders, pin and socket, they go out like that, they, they rotate. He has a very limited elbow, but he still has an elbow. His wrists swivel, and the chains kind of move independently of that. And this one swivels, and it does move back and forth just a little. They're, they're on ball joints. Um, no waist, but I, honestly, I couldn't see this thing with a waist. His legs do move out and back. He has a knee that actually works and nothing at the feet. But really, this guy, once you plant him, he's not really going anywhere because he just he has the weight to hold himself in place. And to show you how big he is, here is the Arkham Asylum Armored Batman figure. And you can see he barely comes up to his thighs and he is actually this is in scale and his hand here is designed to hold Batman so you know you can just put Batman in his hand and he's gonna smash the bat Rrr, Batman Rrr. and that is really cool I mean just awesome I mean, I waited a long time to get this figure. This figure came out a number of years ago. And on the secondary market, it was very expensive. I mean, it was going for well over $100 in some places. Um, retail originally was about 80 I think. I mean, it wasn't a cheap figure to begin with. And I think I found it on Amazon for 60 I want to say. So... Sometimes if you're patient, you find a deal. 
And this was one deal I'm so glad I got. This guy, it's probably one of the best DC figures in my collection. He is just fantastic. And I recommend it for any fan of the Arkham game universe. Um, he is the best of the, the, the figures that were put out. Has better articulation than even some of the others that were put out. It's, it's crazy. So there you go. Well, this is a bit of a quick look. I didn't show the packaging off. I didn't think anybody would care. Um, yeah. Solomon Grundy. Born on a Monday. You better be good. I don't even have to send this guy after you. I could just hit you over the head with him and be do, do some damage. There you go. Yeah. Size. If you want a height, he's about 13 inches. It's about, this, about as tall as uh, Unicron, almost. Yeah. Be good. You don't want him invading your nightmares. Be good.